welcome back to my channel. You're in the right place if you're looking for anything that is low carb diet related. Today, I'm really excited because I get to eat some food. I recently went to Aldi and I found a bunch of low carb snacks and just items that you can get there that I don't know why these just like blew past my radar in the past, but I wanted to share them with you in case you have an Aldi near you. The prices there are amazing and the availability for low carb treats, which I have right here, is awesome. So the only thing, I have five things here. I have only tried one of them so far and I know it's already good, so I rebought that, but then I'm trying four new snacks on camera for you guys today and I'm excited. If you guys didn't know, I am 22 weeks pregnant, so this is not a maternity hoodie, but we're rocking it anyway and I don't care. And we're trying some food today, so I'm super excited. I have some crackers here, some parm crisps, a bar, a snack pack, and what they're calling like a cookie crisp alternative. So if you guys are interested in that, keep watching. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna try just to get it out of the way are the Elevation brand coconut chocolate bars. These are amazing. Now there are a couple different kind of bars that they have at Aldi and they are low carb and they have higher protein and it can be a meal replacement. This one is just like, if you were craving candy bar or some kind of candy, pick these up. This is the chocolate coconut flavor, like I said. I didn't even open any of these yet. And it literally tastes like an Almond Joy or a Mounds. Whatever one doesn't have the nuts in it. It's just like a chocolate coconut bar. So it is this big. So this one calculates out at two grams of carbs per serving. That is if you're going to be discounting the sugar alcohols in it. So I'm gonna show you guys the label here. It's up to you how you wanna calculate your net carbs, but two net carbs is what's written on here. And that's what I like to go by. And I felt like when I had these previously, they didn't affect my, um, my low carb diet at all. I could actually enjoy these for a sweet treat. So you get, how many bars in here? You get five bars per box. And they are this big. And I can't wait to bite into this again because I haven't had these in a while. Delicious. Probably should have taken a smaller bite. I get excited. What do you want from me? So good. It's literally like a chocolate coconut bar, just like the Mounds or Almond Joy bar exactly like that also too i'm going to be putting the prices on the screen for you as i'm talking about them i don't know if i mentioned that earlier but i will do that for you guys because five bars for the prices you can't beat these prices it's just amazing especially compared to like the wegmans and the giants and even like walmart and stuff like the prices are just so much better at aldi the brands are going to be off brands but i found that the products taste just as good as the more popular brands but if you need a candy bar substitute and you don't want to skimp on flavor, highly recommend these Elevation bars. They are super, super good. Okay, so now we're going on to the things that I have not tried yet. So I'm grabbing for these Parmesan crisps. These are Parmesan crisps, nine grams of protein per serving, and I got the jalapeno flavor, and they're zero carb. Hello? I don't know how these could go wrong, uh, you know, as far as taste. Sounds like a like a slam dunk for me, but ooh, they even look pretty. You could totally add these to a platter, like a, um, a charcuterie platter, and these would like pop. They're so pretty. All right, there we go. Let's try it. Crunch is there. Mmm. Okay, so right off the bat, you don't get a strong jalapeno taste at all. There's a little bit of heat on the back end, just on like the back of my tongue, but the Parmesan crisp crunch, A plus, and the Parmesan flavor, A plus. These are just as good as any other expensive Parmesan crisp that I have gotten, and they're zero carb. Perfect addition to your snack bag for lunch when you want something crunchy, like if you're watching a movie, I love Parmesan crisps or if you need a crouton alternative. These are amazing, topped on toe with salad. And you can even like crunch them up too. Perfect. Highly recommend these, the jalapeno flavor. Not super jalapeno-y, but definitely, definitely good. 
and for the price you can't go wrong all right did i mention that these might be my favorite videos to film because i think they are all right we're delving into the next one these are cheddar flavored cauliflower crackers now these remind me of cheez it's and that's the reason I got the cheddar flavor. They also had a sea salt flavor, but I figured, let me get the cheddar and compare it to a cheese it And you guys, you could have 44 of these crackers, 44 for 16 grams of carbs. So even if you ate 22, you're at eight grams of carbs. Hello, that's awesome. So who doesn't like to have a cracker on standby? for when you want a cracker. Okay. All right, so right off the bat, I'm noticing these are like other cauliflower crackers that I've had before. They're thin, definitely thinner. They have a good amount of like the cheese dust on them as well from the bag. Okay. Definitely can tell they're cauliflower. I don't know if I would have said that if I didn't know on the box that I said that, but it has a different taste. It has a cauliflower taste. The cheese dust on them is really good cheddar flavor though. I will say that. I could totally see myself sitting and watching a movie. I'm popping these in. Really good. Or even having them with um, like onion dip or ranch dip for the carb count. They might be dangerous. The more I eat, the less of that cauliflower flavor you're noticing, and it's just focusing on the cheddar. So these are my favorite, but I would buy them again, especially once I'm back low carb, like hardcore low carb, and I need these snacks in my life. Definitely gonna grab these up. And I'm gonna try the sea salt one too. Okay, so I have two things left. I have these coconut cashew crisp cookies, and then I also have the snack selects which remind me a lot of like a balanced break. So I have these two. What I'm gonna do is do the savory first because I'm saving these crisps for last. I really hope they're good. I really, really hope these are good. So those will be on deck, those are next. So the snack selects are gonna be sharp white cheddar cheese, dried cranberries, and sea salt roasted almonds. So these are perfect for on the go. These are so good. I love bringing these in the car, especially like even if we're not going far, I love to bring snacks like wherever I go. Hello, if you guys know me, I'm always thinking about food, always. So I don't ever wanna be left where I'm hungry. So I love having snacks. So does my son, weird, right? So these are always like in my purse, literally. I grab them and we go. That's just how I do it. So like I said, cheddar, I like to do everything in one bite. Cranberry, almond. Is it just me? Or does anybody else do it all in one bite and love it? You have the creamy cheese, the roasted salted cashew, or not cashew, almond. The roasted salted almond, and then the sweet cranberry. Ooh, I just got a kick. Baby girl likes this. So we're gonna do another bite. Cranberry, almond, cheese. So good. And for the carbs, to grab and go something like this that's already put together, yeah, you can make this yourself. Just buy the three ingredients and package it together, but I'm all about convenience. I don't know about you, but this is perfection. Love these for like an afternoon snack or a morning snack after your breakfast, but before lunch or after lunch, perfection. And it's ready to go. It's ready for you. Highly recommend these. Love the flavors too. Very good. We've gotten to the last one. Let's do it. I'm really excited for these. So for eight cookies, they end up being eight grams of carbs, so they're one gram of carb per cookie. And let's see. Okay, they're a little broken. And I have a feeling they're broken because my toddler loves grabbing bags and squeezing them. So that's what we're dealing with right now. Ooh, they're nice and thin. So I actually got the coconut cashew crisp and it is the vanilla flavor. They had other flavors that if these are good, I will definitely try. But I figured let's just go for vanilla. What's wrong with vanilla, coconut, and cashew? Like, that sounds amazing. All right, let's do it. Guys, oh my God. 
That is so good. Let me break it down for you. Snap me out of it. <laughs> Those are amazing. I'm going to eat a lot of these. Okay. Let's close them up for right now. Break it down. The texture is just like you would see a crisp. It just like falls apart in your mouth. Really, really good. A little bit on the chewy side too because of the coconut. The taste is like toasted coconut with sweetness involved too. Really good. Then you get like a vanilla cookie taste right at the end. I highly recommend these. Wow. These were probably my favorite. Yeah. These for the vanilla and then the chocolate, those coconut bars from the beginning. So good. So, so, so good. In my previous video, I was talking about cookies and how it's hard to get the right texture and the right taste and to keep them low carb. You don't need to even try. I'm just going to be buying these. <laughs> these are seriously so good. And I love coconut. If you love coconut, you have to try these. They're pretty much guilt free. I'm so happy with that haul. That is amazing. The only thing, like I said, that wasn't really my favorite were the cauliflower crackers, but even they were really, really good. So I would call that a win. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, definitely give me a thumbs up. If you love talking all things low carb, diet tips, tricks, recipes, everything and anything, then definitely subscribe to my channel. If you didn't know, I do have a blog where all my recipes are written out. It's gonna be linked down below. It's the Little Piece of Heart blog. I would love to have you guys subscribe to that as well so that every time I post a new recipe, even if I don't make a new YouTube video, you get notified. So you can be up to date with all of that. But with all of that said, this was so fun. If you guys like taste test videos, let me know down in the comments. And if there's anything else from Aldi that you love. Oh, by the way, Aldi, they have a low carb bread. I believe it's a zero carb bread. I went there looking for it, which is what sparked this haul. But I went there looking for it and the girl that worked there literally told me, everyone has been coming in there asking about it, but they haven't gotten it in yet and to keep checking back. So as soon as I get that bread, get my hands on that bread, I will be making a video. So stay tuned for that and subscribe just for that because if I can find a low carb bread that I think they had it labeled at $3 for a loaf that I can buy locally, I mean, that would be a game changer, especially if it tastes good. So all that said, hope you guys have a wonderful day and I will see you really soon with a new video. Bye everybody.